Hi everyone, in this video I am going to show you how to get the address latitude value and longitude value from the graph which is by using the draw marker or drawable marker. So what you need to do is just copy the code in the description given below and create a one HTML file, plain HTML file and paste it in that file and open it in browser. So I will show you the live demonstration. No need to worry, the whole code is in the description below, given below. So what you need to do is just go to any desired location and just create a new file. Its name be anything. Uh, for now, let's I am doing it as map.html. Sorry. Yeah, click on OK for uh, naming the extension and just double click on it. It's open in any editor which you like to open. So all the plain HTML tags is written. So let the title be map. And what you need to do is just three things. One is as you, sh as you are seeing here, one is due and three input fields are required. So just do that. So go to the source code in the description given below just copy these lines and paste it here do as i am doing and what we need next is style so just copy the style and paste after next to the tile till tags and finally what we need to is we need to get this address and we need to show the map so that code that code is written in javascript just copy that code and after next to that style tag just paste that code all you need is done that's it just save the file and go to the file location and just click on open with the browser it's loading and it's done see map.html now you are getting whenever you want to just move the more undrawable mover you just drop it there and it shows the address and automatically this address is getting in the input field and latitude and longitude so these values can be used while using the forms so that the person can dynamically pick the address so that you can get the address easily it saves you a lot of time and one more thing i would like to say is here i used uh, i did not use any api this is a api which i used for my purpose if you want to use your own api just remove this after the question mark just remove this here in this place replace your google api if you don't know how to access google api just type in the browser google api key and just click on enter so you will get that link i hope so so click on one so scroll down see here get a key so click on that uh, button uh, so it's asked for google login just sign up and get the key this is the process just it's a simple two-step process thanks for watching